for years, that's where I was at. I was like, I want a journal. I love to write. For some reason, I had this like pull to the practice, but I was like, I don't know how to do it Mm -hmm. because I felt like I was, you know, too old to be talking about like the crush that I had or the thing that someone did that made me angry that day. And so I really just pushed off the practice and pushed off the practice for years. And what I'll say, like, kind of brought me in was just the simple practice of gratitude journaling. So I started doing that every single day. And that kind of opened the door to be like, there is something here, like something more here. And then once I got into meditation, it's for me, it's actually this combination of meditation and journaling that really clicks for me. Um, And a big, a big part of this, because I know it can be a little scary to just be looking at that blank page and being like, I don't know what to write. And it's okay. If you just write out, like start writing, I don't know what to write. And you just like brain dump all of whatever comes up. And maybe it is about your sister that made you angry or the crush that doesn't like you and like, let that be okay. But I find if we can kind of keep going you can get deeper and deeper and deeper. And I think the more that we do it, the deeper that we can go. Um, And when I pair it with meditation, like where that combination comes in is I find I can kind of get the ego out of the way first. And then I can tap in so much deeper. Um, And for me, that often looks like just in the morning, I'll meditate and I'll just set my intention for the day and I'll write that out. 